Hi guys, this is the introduction to R part 6. In this part, we will see the matrix multiplication. Previously, we have seen the vector multiplication and how to deal with graphics, web, and external data files. In this part, we will see the matrix. So, how to create a matrix in the first place? To create a matrix, we need some data. Let's call it D is sequence of 1 up to 25 with one interval in each. Now let's create the matrix. D with number of room equals 5 and number of column equals 5 and we want to put the data in a way that they are arranged by row so this is our matrix so this is one two three four five which was in by row and our original data was d which is one two three four five six up to twenty five so in the matrix you say it's one two three four five and then again six seven eight nine ten and so on so let's give the matrix a name let's put in and let's see what is in so yeah this is recorded as our matrix and we can extract values from the matrix like if we put in one comma that means the first row you see the first row and if we put in in square bracket two comma two that means seven you see it's in the original matrix in second row second column the element is seven and when you put in two two this also brings up the seven okay what about the enter second row we can try like this in okay five you see the enter second row is there Let's try something else. Like I don't want the entire thing. I need something more specific. So three, four, five, six, eight, ten, which is the first, third, and fifth element of the matrix from row to first, third, fifth. So this is how it works. Also, if we want all the elements except first, third, fifth, which are obviously sixth and ninth from the row two. This is seven and nine. It's shown in the matrix. So this is how we deal with the matrix as we have done previously in the part 5 we dealt with external data let's see how we can do it here using the external data let's say data was read from table and the location is oops after write it again the excel report down key okay always data equals read dot table then oops it's not happening it's happening again come on table 
see outlander text. Let's see in the external file outline in C drive we have the data file and the data file is like this where we had run conk and density as variable names so we try to find the file in R as well but we forgot to put the header we have to put the header because there are headers in the in that file so yeah so let's see what we have recorded so far this is the data one yeah and like in the same way we can see data one first row or first five rows and first five rows with second and third element uh, not element second and third column you see or we could do minus one that means first in first five elements but exclude the first column let's see first five rows first column is deleted so this command and this command both has to be the same so this is how we deal with the external files hope you enjoyed it so see you next time bye for now